Hello everyone, I'm going to do a review and show you how to use the Keurig K-Express. So this Keurig does standard K-Cups. You've got a 12 ounce, 10 ounce, 8 ounce you can do, and you can also do a strong brew. It's got a power button, it's got an add water light, and a descale light. I like this that it's got a really small footprint. It's got a really nice removable water reservoir on the back. Front to back, it's only about 12 inches. Left to right, it's about four and a half. And with the lid open, it's right at about 17 and a half inches. So it's got their standard single needle in the top and the single needle on the bottom with this really nice handle. So let's brew a cake up. You simply just set the cake up in there. When you close the handle, it's going to pierce the top and the bottom. Then the controls start to flash. If you want to do a strong brew, you would select strong brew or you can deselect it. Let's do a strong brew. I like to brew my coffees on eight ounces. Once you press the eight ounce button, it starts to brew. It's a really fast coffee maker and very quiet. So the coffee coming out the bottom is 192. That's a really hot cup of coffee. So in less than a minute, you got a really hot cup of coffee. So the coffee tastes really good out of here. It'll, like I said, it'll brew any standard K-Cup. It doesn't have to be made by Keurig, but it'll brew any standard K-Cup. Cleanup is very simple. You just lift the lid. Be careful. These can be hot. This is a great starter Keurig. If you've never had a Keurig before, this would make a great machine. Thanks everybody for watching.